guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to be sharing with you today my baby boy haul. This is the first haul that I'm going to be doing for our baby boy. Um, this is everything that we've bought up to this point for him except for his crib and his changing table. Um, so I'm excited to share it with you, so let's dive right in. So I'm going to start with bibs. We've only bought a few of these because we do have some from our daughter that we're going to reuse with him that were like gender neutral ones um, and that weren't too stained or anything. So. These ones we got at Marshall's and I thought they were super cute. They were on sale for $3.99, so for three bibs I didn't think that was too bad. The next set that we got had five and these were at TJ Maxx and let's see if there's a price. We got these ones for $4.99 and they're really cute. They're just like navy blue, gray, and then there's a yellow one too. So I thought these were really cute for him. So for outfits, so far we only have a few outfits. We don't have a ton of clothes. We are having a sprinkle and I know a lot of people tend to bring clothes to sprinkle so I wanted to kind of hold off on clothes just in case we get a lot there. We don't like overdo it with clothes like we did with Madeline. So, but this one I just couldn't pass up. It's a size newborn and I got it at Carter's and it was on sale, I believe it was 50% off so it was $11. So I thought this could be a cute coming home outfit, but I haven't decided for sure yet. This next one I got at Marshall's as well, and I thought it was just the cutest thing ever. This, there's no price on it, but it's by, oh here, nope, no price. But it's by Baby Essentials, and it says, ain't no daddy like the one I got, and it has this onesie with the little hat, like a knot hat, and then the pants to match the hat. So I thought it was super cute and it's three months so he should be able to wear it for a while. The next few pieces I got at H&M and if you haven't checked out H&M Kids yet, they do have a really good selection of things and they aren't too expensive so I kind of like shopping there. Some of their things are a little bit more expensive but a lot of the basic stuff is pretty cheap. So I got this set of two onesies and these are the side snap onesies which are good um, for in the hospital after like for their umbilical cord just being a little bit gentle um, and these ones their sizes are a little different so this is two to four month so I got a navy blue one and then a blue and white stripe one and it was both of these for $12.99 which wasn't too bad I didn't think these will be the only ones that I buy with the side snaps because I like to stick to zippers um, but for the umbilical cord portion, I thought it'd be nice to have some of these on hand. The next one is one of my favorite little outfits I've gotten for him so far. This one is also from H&M and it's also two to four months. It's light blue and it just says Brothers Rule on it. I actually used it in our gender reveal photo on Instagram. So if you're not following me on Instagram, definitely go follow me. I'd love to have you there too. And it comes with blue and white striped pants, which I thought were so cute. And then a little, um, knot hat to go with it. So. I thought this was just adorable. It was at H&M for $12.99. And then this next one is from Gymboree. It doesn't have the tag on it anymore, but it's zero to three months and it says little bro. And it's like a little um, like romper kind of. I don't know if they call them rompers for boys, but a little romper. And it has little pockets on the back, which I thought were so cute. But it actually matches. I got a shirt for Madeline that says big sis on it and it's pink. So I thought that would be a cute outfit for them to wear together. Okay, these next few um, pieces are going to be like onesie sets that I got different places, so I'll just go over the place that I got them. Um, so this one is a set of five. They're Gerber onesies and they are from Target. So they have a puppy dog, a stripe, another stripe, a puppy dog, face one, and then this last one says be strong. So I thought these were really cute. It doesn't have a price on it anymore, but it was at Target. I want to say it was right around $12. So for five onesies, I didn't think that was too bad. These next ones I got at Carter's, and I got them on clearance. Let's see. So I got both of these. They both have, one has five and one has four, for $12 a piece. Um, so this one's just basic onesies. There's nothing on any of them, which I kind of like. Um, I've gravitated towards these colors for him for almost all of his clothes, you'll notice. So I really like these ones. These are in a size three months. And then I also got these short sleeve ones um, that I thought were super cute, just little bears and stripes and cute little bears. And then this one says handsome little fella. So these were both um, at Carter's for $12. They were on clearance though, so they might be a little bit more expensive, but they are three months um, onesies. So these are cute too. The next two I got at Marshall's and these ones are kind of cool because they're like grow with me bodysuits. Um, 
so they're both short sleeve but um, so there's two in here that are zero to three and then three in here that are three to six months which I thought was kind of cool um, but they're just kind of the same color scheme I've been going with and um, I thought they were really cute but they're Marshalls for $9.99 and then these are that same brand these the brand of these last two is chickpea these ones were actually at TJ Maxx it looks like also for $9.99 so we have two of the zero to three month and then three of the three to six month so I thought those were a good deal and they're nice and neutral um, I've been trying to stick with like neutrals and blues for him just because I really like those colors um, I don't really want a bunch of the bright neon colors for him I don't know why just kind of a weird thing um, but this is probably the brightest one we have we got this is his only set of newborn sleepers that we have um, we got these at Target they're by Cloud Island and they were $12.99 so we have this one a blue like triangle one and then a navy blue with this print I thought they were really cute Adam actually picked these out for him so that's that's kind of cute okay these next one I got on clearance at Target so they were originally $12.99 they were on clearance for $9.08 um, and so there's a spaceship, a stripes, and like an astronaut space one. Um, and these I got in zero to three months, so I think these are really cute too. And then the last pair of bodysuits that we got for him, we actually got these as a gift. Um, and we got these, they are from Target from the Cloud Island section. Since they were a gift, I'm not sure how much they were, but I'm in love with them. They're zero to three months, and they are the zip, um, zip like PJs. And so we have this one, a gray stripe one, and then this one has like constellations on it. I don't know if you can see that, but it's super cute. Um, and all of these ones have the fold over mittens for the for their hands. So I like that about these as well. So I really think that these are going to be super cute for him. Um, and if you're a new mom and you've never bought sleepers before or have experience with that, definitely get the zipper ones. Don't get the button ones or the snap ones. You really don't want to be messing with that in the middle of the night. The zipper is the way to go. So I'm so excited to have these on him. Okay, so the last couple pieces of clothing that I have for him are some pants. Um, I got both of these sets at Nordstrom Rack and they are the brand Joe Fresh. They're three to six month, all of them. And I got each two pack for 12 bucks. So this two pack came with a navy blue and a light gray and they're just like super cute little like rolled up sweatpants that I thought were adorable and then this pack came with black and dark gray so we do still need to get in pants for that are a little bit smaller when Madeline was born she wore newborn for like a month and a half so I'm kind of interested to see what he ends up wearing and I'm a little nervous because we don't have a ton of newborn stuff yet but we'll see so those are all the clothes I have so far um, and I really love all of them so I'm excited to see what I get at the sprinkle and then what we add to it I'll definitely do a second baby boy haul for you um, this next part is gonna be more of like nursery accessories and gear so let's get started with that so first I'm gonna start with um, some sheets that we got for him we got these Burt's Bees baby sheets um, they're white and light blue stripes. I can't, I don't know if you can tell in the screen, um, but they're super cute. They're just a fitted, fitted crib sheet and we got them at Bye Bye Baby, but I know they also have them at Target. Um, so I don't remember how much they were. I think they're around $12 though. Next ones, this brand is Hello Spud. It's a fitted crib sheet, organic cotton. Um, these ones we got at Bye Bye Baby. These were a little bit more expensive. I want to say $20, um, but they're so cute. If you can see the little giraffe with the bow tie. So it's a gray giraffe with a navy bow tie, which is so adorable. So Adam picked these ones out. The next thing for kind of sleep is this Halo Sleep Sack, so <laughs> Halo sleep sack Swaddle. Um, we used this with Madeline and we absolutely loved it, so I'm hoping that he likes it too. Um, we only got one just in case he doesn't, but we did get it in newborn size because this goes from birth to three months, so that should be good for a little bit. And it's kind of cool because it has the wings, but then eventually when they're too big and they can roll over, you can do it with their arms out so they still feel secure. So that's why we really like these ones. This one we got at Bye Bye Baby, um, and I don't remember the price, but I know they also sell them at Target. So 
Um, if you're looking for a good transition swaddle, I definitely check this one out. Okay, and then this one we got as a gift as well. I think it's from Target, just based off of like the brand and everything. Um, it is Carter's, and it just has a little elephant on it, and it says Little Cutie. I don't know the price because we got it as a gift, but I'm super excited um, to cuddle him with this little blanket. So next we'll do socks and shoes. We only have a few things for him as far as this goes. Like I've said in the previous videos, we are really behind on getting stuff for him. So this is like, I feel like I don't have a ton of stuff to show you. Like this is a lot of stuff, but it's not nearly what we'll need. So, um, but this is our start. So we have a pair of Carter's socks. So there's a six pack and I got these at Marshall's. Um, I thought they were so cute with the little paw and the trees. And then these other sides are like stripes and just plain. Um, but they're zero to three months and we got six pairs of them for $4.99. So I thought that was a really good deal. And then these next ones are, um, looks like Goldbug is the brand and they're zero to three month and we got a six pack of them. These ones were at Bye Bye Baby and Adam picked these out. So I'm not exactly sure what the price was, but they're super cute little boy socks. And then we've gotten him a couple pairs of shoes. We got both of these, oh, it looks like, so one of these we got at Toys R Us before they closed and they are the Koala Baby brand for $12.99. I know we got these on sale so I'm not sure what we spent on them but the tag says $12.99. They're just like a little brown loafer type shoe. I thought that they would be cute for um, Thanksgiving because he'll only be like a little over a month old at Thanksgiving. Well actually almost two months at Thanksgiving. So I thought these would be super cute as like little dress up shoes for him. So these brown ones, and then we got these ones at Marshall's, but they are by Carter's. Um, we got these for $5, they're three to six month, and they're navy blue with like light blue on the back. So I thought those were just cute. Um, I know we don't, we never really put Madeline in a ton of shoes unless we went out and she was gonna be out of her blanket when she was little. So we've only gotten a couple pairs of shoes just because we mostly use socks. Um, at that age, they kick their shoes off a lot, so I just get, get these for, like, pictures more than anything else, I feel like. So, um, the next thing is this cute little snuggle. This is also something that we got as a gift. Um, it's the brand Cloud Island, so it's from Target. I'm not sure the price, but I think it is so cute, and it actually matches some of the PJs that we got for him. So, I'm super excited to see him love this, and Madeline already has, like, claimed this little guy as her own, like she thinks that he is hit, he is hers. So we're gonna have to figure that out once um, baby comes. They do have a really cute unicorn one that I've seen there for little girls. So I was kind of thinking in her gift from the baby, we could put the unicorn one so then they both get to have one. I'm not sure, but I thought this was super cute. So now on to more of the product stuff. We got the Upper Baby Vista adapter. So we do have the Upper Baby Vista stroller. We've had it since we first had Madeline and we absolutely love it. If you haven't seen the Upper Baby stroller, it looks like this and it allows you to adapt the infant car seat, the toddler seat, and then the bassinet. So we have all of those pieces already. Um, and then you just need the little adapters to do that. So we just bought this and then we'll have to get the lower adapters. They were just out of them. We got this one for $20 at Bye Bye Baby. And then the next thing is the Frida Baby Windy. Um, and if you haven't heard of this, I would suggest checking it out. We didn't use it with Madeline because we never really needed to. Um, she was a pretty easy baby. I feel like we could have probably used it with her, but we just never bought it. But, oop! But this time around, we're definitely going to try it. Um, we've heard from a ton of friends that this is like a lifesaver. So it's a little interesting, um, but we will see. I will keep you guys posted for sure because I know as new moms, these things can be a little tricky and a little scary. So I'll let you know how it goes. Um, but this one we got at Bye Bye Baby. I know they sell them at Target as well, and I don't remember what we paid for them. But So the next thing is um, Little Unicorn um, cotton muslin swaddles. So <laughs> Adam took these out and looked at them already. That's why they're a little messed up. There's three in here. Um, and they're like dinosaur theme, which I thought was kind of cute. Let's see, yeah, there's the dinosaur one. So they're really cute and perfect for a little boy. Um, but we actually got these on clearance at Target. So I was super excited. We got them for $26 and they were originally $37. So I thought that was a really good deal for three swaddles. We haven't got a lot of swaddles yet because we do have a lot that we're going to reuse from Madeline, so that's kind of nice. Um, we tried to buy a lot of gender neutral swaddles with her so that we could reuse them and it definitely came in handy this time because we've only bought 
one new set just to replenish and make it feel like he has his own. The next thing we bought for him is this Brika Stretch to Fit sunshade. Um, we have a different sunshade from Madeline and we really don't like it so we wanted to try this one. Um, it like stretches to fit on the window and then just like sections on there. So I will let you guys know what we think of this. Like I said, the one we used with Madeline we didn't like. It was just a pain and it never stayed up the right way. Um, and it didn't really fully block the sun, so I felt like it was more of a nuisance than anything. So I'm hoping this one does a little bit better. And then as far as diapering goes, um, I wanted to bring this up because I thought this would be a good thing to share with other moms who might be shopping for their babies right now. Um, I've been getting a few packs of Honest Diapers, like almost every time I go to Marshalls. They have sets of them there, and they're like on a super sale. So I think I got some of them for like 6 bucks for a pack, which is less than half price. Um, so I did only, we only got one set of newborn just to see if he wears newborn for very long um, and then we got a few sets of one and two. We do have Madeline on the Honest um, diaper bundle so eventually we'll set him up on that as well. But this is just to kind of get us started since I'm not sure what his size will be. Um, plus it's a good deal. So if you're looking for Honest diapers, we really do love Honest diapers. I do feel like their prints have kind of gone downhill a little bit but um, they're the only diaper that Madeline doesn't get a rash with. So, um, if you're looking for some, check Marshalls because they have them on sale right now, which is really cool. We got these multi-use pads. Um, we use these with Madeline and they didn't really, I don't feel like we necessarily needed them, but I feel like with a little boy we definitely will. So we use these under her, under the diaper changer cover. So we have like the diaper changing pad and then we put this down and then the cover on top of it. It's just like an extra waterproof layer to help soak everything up and keep everything as clean as possible. Um, so I got one pack of these. We got these at Bye Bye Baby and I don't remember how much they are, um, but they really did come in handy. So um, there's those. And then the last thing is this. This is his um, changing pad set. I don't know if you can see it fully. Um, but it is by Summer Infant, which is a really good brand. I've bought some of their stuff before and I really like it. So it comes with the changing pad, two changing pad covers, um, and two changing pad protectors. So um, I'm not in love with the color of this. It doesn't match his nursery at all. But I feel like for the price, I got all of these things for $24. So I feel like for the price, it was a good deal. Um, I am going to buy different covers. Also, so that we have a few extra and ones that actually match his nursery for when we have people over. I know that sounds just nuts, but that's kind of what I'm going to do. So, um, there's that. So I hope you enjoyed my baby boy haul video. I do feel like there are not a lot of baby boy hauls out there, so I'm going to try to do a couple more um, as we get closer. I want to do one more of the stuff that we buy for him, and then one haul of the stuff that we get at the shower. I'm also buying a few things for him on Etsy that I'm going to include in those hauls, or I might do a separate Etsy haul, depending on how much I get there. But um, if you're interested in that, please click the subscribe button. I would love to have you a part of my YouTube family. And if you enjoy this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I will see you in my next video.